What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, reliable AMT, make sure to hit up my sponsor and use code BUGS for 5% off checkout. Links down below in the description. Hit them up right now. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today we are going over the market and seeing what prices are going to drop, what prices are going to go up. Before we get into the video, guys, let's hit that like goal of 50 likes. Smash that like button, comment down below, and sub. Because if you do all those three things, you guys will um, qualify for a giveaway on Instagram and Twitter. And if you follow the Instagram and Twitter, you have an even better chance of winning the 100,000 MT giveaway. And um, not, I'm pretty sure I'm going to do 250K MT giveaway winners. So um, like it up, sub it up, all that good stuff. And um, if you guys do need MT, any grinding service is done. I do sell MT, buy MT as well, and also doing any type of grinding services, whether it's limited and all that good stuff, but uh, here it is, man. We got the new content, Tracy McGrady, Amari Stoudemire, David West, Kawhi Leonard, and um, honestly, before we get into this, I'm going to show you my um, challenges I've done. I'm trying to get a Stoudemire and a Tracy McGrady for a decent price. I've done every single one. I'm definitely not locking in Cohen or cohen's whatever dunkers all done not locking in jace move done with this not locking in shrimp as you guys can see man on level 35 level 35 we're out here grinding bro and um we're about to play limited just trying to get a t-mac so i can play some unlimited and um limited um but yeah we're gonna get into the market let's go over tracy mcgrady's price the man himself so whew, he is at 450 on xbox um to be honest with you guys i'm not gonna pay that price i'm gonna try to get him for around 350 i don't know if i can get him for 350 but we're gonna try we gotta try we gotta try so let's see how much left is on the auction because one thing here's another thing with tracy mcgrady i would think his car is gonna go down but then again every time a tracy mcgrady gets le released <clears throat> he is the best card in the game um looking at it defensively he's not the best but offensively it's tracy mcgrady he's gonna be up there so i'm trying to get him for around this price 330 that would be an ideal price and then stoudemire let's check out his price uh if you guys want i'm gonna show you some snipe filters in this video after we go over some pricing and then we got amari stoudemire the man the myth the legend uh pink diamond i wish i could get him for cheap but uh he's actually 124k not a bad idea to get him right now he probably will drop to even more as you guys can see he's not common whatsoever he's not common like at all um so he might go down to 100k i'm not totally sure i definitely want to do solos but i kind of want to wait on this stoudemire because i don't know man i feel like he might go down in value and i don't want to lose any more mt i already lost hundreds of thousands of mt trying to grind for blake so like in my opinion man it's kind of hard to tell what their price are going to range at for my opinion, I think Tracy McGrady is going to go down in value and then he's going to rise back up this weekend. I don't think he's going to go that much uh, down just because, like I said, he's the most hyped card in the game. Who doesn't want Tracy McGrady on the squad? Um, I'm going to try bidding about 300-ish K on this one. Maybe we could get him. If we get him, that'd be a W. I'm going to go for like 340. Probably not going to get him for that. But if we do, that is an ideal price. So let's go over some other cards real quickly and then we'll go into some quick quick snipe filters we got diamond bucks man the boy Giannis on tentacumpo uh five minutes left man there's actually a pretty decent amount of Giannis is up here he's definitely not a good time to sell any cards there is a little bit of a market crash mono Ginobili. if you guys want to scoop one up for the low now is the time to do so so that just ended for 400 and something k this one's about to end for 400k so maybe he does drop down to around 300 and something k 455 oof let's see what this one ends for 373 he'll probably end up getting out but it's like 420 so ooh, that one for 70 uh never mind 86k that's not bad um looking at the market though oof, tracy mcgrady is definitely up there in value uh we probably already got outbidded but uh, i'm trying to work my mt up i'm gonna show you some filters I'm going to show you this filter to start off with, man. It's a long shot, but here it is, man, the Possessed filter. You could either get a Tracy McGrady or an Amari Stoudemire. You never know what you could get. It's kind of interesting. It's very interesting. I want to show you Kawhi. I did pull Kawhi Leonard today. 
So let's check out his value real quick. Yeah, he's 100K. I just threw him up for 100K and he sold instantly. He's really not worth putting up for a bid. You could pretty much just put him up for 100K. He's nothing crazy. I did play a couple games with him. I'm honestly going to try to bid snipe him right here for like, let's try to do it for like 87K. Ah, uh, yeah, I already got up. It is. Figures, 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 figures. So right now, man, looking at the auction and whatnot, it's like kind of a lot, guys. It is a lot. Let's go over the Amethyst 20 filter. Let's see how this snipe filter is doing today. Let's check out the LeBrons. And also, if you guys have Ru, Ru Kamukamara, I think his name is, on the Wizards. Ooh, see. Ooh, we got that. Okay. I guess this filter is dead. Unless he's really that badly down in price, which no way he is. 12K. I'm picking up all these Amethyst 20s. And yeah, that one's bought out already. So if you guys see any Giannis's for that price, that is a clear snipe. Uh, I'm surprised that was still left on the auction. I'm definitely snagging this one on a... Oh, ADs for 15k. That's a pretty good value. Uh, yeah, definitely try to stick to this filter, man. This is one of my favorite filters in the game to this day. Uh, it's the Amethyst 20 filter. We just got that Giannis for 11k. He will rise. He will probably rise to around 20k. And honestly, he's probably 20k right now. But yeah, this filter is definitely one of my favorite filters in the game right now. Uh, another filter I do love shooting guard amethyst it's quicker mt donovan mitchell's on it richie guerin's on it uh steve smith's on it there's just a lot going on michael cooper Harden. uh the list goes on so definitely try out the shooting guard amethyst filter it's definitely a good filter now i don't know if you can apply clamps to tracy mcgrady i don't think you can so what you guys should do i have a feeling clamps is gonna go up in value so let's look over here at clamps let's see what it's going for man uh i feel like clamps and range extender might be key badges to snipe this weekend it looks like clamps did go up a lot i picked one up yesterday for 12k all right nothing crazy it's up to 14k i feel like you should watch this badge try sniping it out same with range extender these are badges you always want to pay attention to especially when new content drops because if you get like Kawhi leonard range extender he's pretty damn solid same with jimmy butler unless they have him already i'm not totally sure but um hmm. david west he's another good snipe filter man um any of the new cards another way hold up i gotta show you this one because i actually missed a donovan mitchell for 10k on this one and it's possessed amethyst you get my boy jimmy butler or donovan mitchell on this filter and uh, i already did their solos already did their challenges i should say i keep saying solos like it's madden uh, but here it is, man. This filter right here. Absolutely cash. You never know what's going to pop up. Donovan Mitchell, man. Missed him for 10K. 10,000 MT for Donovan Mitchell. So that was kind of tough. These are very good budget cards. Donovan Mitchell and Jimmy Butler. I feel like the filter is low-key hot. If you guys want to sit on this filter, not a bad idea. Uh, let's check out on the Ruby end. Let's see how much the Rubies are going for. I mean, they're pretty cheap. They have to be cheap considering the fact of how easy it is to pull them so yeah ruby filter if you guys want to stack up on thorough baileys not a bad idea this card's actually really really good so if you see any cheap ones for like a thousand mt i'm scooping that one up for a thousand mt man this guy's a beast he's mad lanky 611 he can play the small forward he's a very good small forward especially in limited so honestly I'm going to scoop up a couple for 1100 a 1000 I say his price does rise up to 2000 Definitely a good idea. Not going to lie. I feel like he's definitely worth the MC. He is a ruby. Let's see how many bad. He's 15 gold bad. It's three. Um, def definitely, definitely a solid card. Especially for the height at small forward. Most definitely a solid card. Uh, definitely worth the pickup. I think for a 1000 MT, you really can't go wrong. So definitely try scooping him up. You can maybe even get them for a little bit cheaper. You never know. Oh, uh, yeah. This one was definitely bought out, too. So definitely try out that guy. Uh, let's see. What else do we got? Tracy McGrady. Am I winning this bid? I'm going to actually bid a little bit more. Maybe I can win. I don't know. I don't know. It's a moment of truth with that Tracy McGrady. Let's check out his price one more time. And, um, yo, if you guys are wondering what should you get C-Mac at, man, it's kind of it's kind of scary. I don't know, man. I don't know. But uh, other than that, that's really all we got for the video. I just showed you my best snipe filters. I'm going to show you one more snipe filter that I think is pretty good. And it is Diamond Cheapest. I think that actually might be a snipe. 
Diamond cheapest. Uh, it's actually not snipe. So diamond cheapest. You never know what's gonna pop up on this filter either. I did snipe myself out. I forgot what card it was, but whatever it was. Oh, it was Greg Odin. The Greg Odin glitch. But uh, yeah, man, that's really all we got for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. We might run a stream very late night. I will let you guys know on Twitter or Instagram if we do. And that is all we got for the video. Make sure to like it up, sub it up for the giveaway. And yo, that's all we got. Have a good one. Peace. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure you hit me up on Instagram and Twitter. I am buying and selling MT. Hit me up right now.